astrologists name today as Newbies Day in trading. <laughs> just, just kidding. Still, this video could not have been uploaded any other day. And in it you will find the simplest and at the same time the most interesting synergy of indicators. This synergy has helped me turn a profit hundreds if not thousands of times across many years in trading. And if you don't trust me with this, our team that hosts our Telegram channel has seen and discovered so many quality signals where this combination helped too. So don't forget to subscribe to our Telegram channel if you want to learn something new and trust me, there's plenty to learn there. So what is this dream combination I'm speaking of? It's magged and stochastic, and what a combination it is. They complement each other just perfectly. I think everybody knows what those two indicators look like, or should I say one indicator and one oscillator to be more precise. Both open in a separate window below the chart, and they help us in cases where you know that there should be a good entry point, but you can't pinpoint it just yet. So. Magd shows trade volumes where bulls or bears dominate, how many of them are active, and it reflects any changes in that. Stochastic, on the other hand, does a very similar thing, but without trade volumes, and its lines are much smoother. Using both allows you to increase your chances to turn a profit pretty much twofold. And by the way, note that I'm not using the default stochastic settings, I change its periods to 26, 6 and 6, which helps me analyze the market a bit more carefully. And yeah, most importantly, still you have to analyze the market. I'm saying this because those instruments can only help you do it, but they won't guarantee you profit every time you see them show something. So analysis first, indicators second. Alright, let's do some of that in practice. First, we see the market trading in a downtrend here. It reaches the lower support, then rebounds with a large jump in volumes. With it, the price reaches the trend line and the resistance. But the latter does hold, and the market goes back down again. Alright, great analysis. Even better than that, our indicators reflect the same things. A downtrend, a bull's rally that eventually loses momentum, and an eventual decline in trade volumes. So we opt for a 10 minute put here. Beautiful, isn't it? Alright, move on to the next one. We see another downtrend here, and the market has reached the resistance and starting to turn around. Well, I guess it's pretty much impossible to see an entry point here. I can almost hear the indicator shout, and to the market, no! You know, but uh, they don't. Magd shows decreasing bulls volumes and increasing bears momentum. And our stochastic paints us a gorgeous sea. Its lines are reminiscent of summer breeze and crossing each other in the overbought zone. Everything tells us to go short, so a 10 minute put it is. At first I was in shock by how easy it was trading using those two instruments, but now it's nothing special for me and our team. By the way, this week has been quite amazing with so many interesting trades and market analysis, so check out what we do in our telegram, we'll be happy to see you there. And now, let's see what else we can find with this combination. Here's what the indicators look like when the market takes its time to consolidate. The indicator lines see some vibrations, but the trend is still clear as day. In this case, the market forms the triangle pattern and it's just getting ready to finish. And our indicators are gradually moving from the overbought to the oversold zone. Now that's another 10 minute put for us. No other way to put it, you know. <laughs> and yes, that was the right move. Another trade turns us a profit, third time in a row already. All right. I think we can establish a good tradition here. I show you a chart and give you 5 seconds to tell me where the market will go and why. Feel free to pause the video. Pretty easy, right? That's it, 10 minute call. As you've probably noticed, the market's trading in a local downtrend. 
But the price follows this line and now it can rebound off it. And what helps me most are our indicators. MAG shows us that the trade volumes are getting on the bull side and our stochastic lines are beginning to cross in the oversold zone. We see countless situations like this one trading and we post a lot of them in our Telegram channel. But as for this video, I think it's time to wrap it up. And remember the most important thing. You must always analyze the markets. All those instruments can only help you with that. But you also need to understand how to use them right. And of course, don't forget to check out what we post in our Telegram channel. I want to think that we share some interesting and quality information there. And information, as you know, it rules the world. See you in our future video. And as always, stay safe and be in touch.